Well, I just finished revamping an old project of mine. I've made a video of it before, but I wasn't really impressed with it myself. It was just to see if I could, so it had a lot of loose ends. So, here's the newly revamped Super Nintendo Ferrari. All new paint job, including the cartridge slot. This is Super Nintendo right there. All this does is sit there and cover that dude up. Now, the back end's all redone, painted. So, awesome. I actually cleaned the inside. Believe it or not, this Ferrari came out of a dumpster. I found it in a dumpster. I jumped in and got it. It was white, it was covered in dirt, and who knows what else. But I saw it. I needed a place to put the circuitry for my Super Nintendo. Believe it or not, this is my original Super Nintendo from when I was a kid. It got lost in storage for three years, and by the time I found it, the plastic had all yellowed and dried out, and when you pick it up, it would crumble in your hand. So, what do you do with a Super Nintendo with no case? You find a new case. So, this is what I came up with. I have the power light on the dash. Oh, it actually flashed. That's pretty cool. Um, switches the gear shift. Now, what I didn't show you in the previous video is the wheels would fall off when you picked it up. It was. <laughs> completely held together by gravity, or if I moved it at all in the video, it's because I had tape underneath it. Now, that's not the case. Let's remove everything that's going to fall off. Everything is nicely buttoned up. Even a nice metal shield that I made, covering up any last bit of ugliness that used to be the Super Nintendo. It's still pretty clean. Mattel Inc. 1986. That strike came out pretty nice myself. Well, enough looking at it. Let's play it. I found the best picture for your retro gaming experience comes from a rear projection television set, which can be picked up at any local dumpster for absolutely free. Now, without further ado, Zombies Ate My Neighbors.
Either way, you get the picture. It's hard to play this game with one hand, so I'm going to get to it. Let me know what you think of this thing, and thanks for watching.